since the death of one of the most influential figures in recent American history, and his teachings are still praised, his words beloved. One local college has vowed to never go a full year without honoring the memory of Martin Luther King Jr. Russell Colburn brings you to the Keeping the Dream Alive event that went on at Bishop Community College. 87 years and two days since the birth of Martin Luther King Jr. His name is praised to a packed Yvonne Kennedy Auditorium, where you'd be hard pressed to find someone his words mean more to than DeWitt Ford. But Martin Luther King Jr. provided the candle along with the light. The adversity that he had to face at the beginning of his whole entire endeavor with trying to make that change and make that peace amongst every single race and uh, looking at the character and integrity in the person, it was, it was tremendous for me. Ford is a business administration student who plans to become one of the only African American CEOs of a Fortune 500 company. He's also Mr. Bishop State. That's a student leader right under the SGA president. Oh, and by the way, he's a freshman. So just as the civil rights leader did, Ford is starting early. He won't go into the clergy like King. Politics are more his forte. He says he would like to run for mayor. Dr. Martin Luther King doesn't do what he did. This dream is not possible, right? That is absolutely true. That is absolutely true. The walk that he did and the way that he did it and he stressed peace, it's it's amazing and it's truly a blessing in disguise. Martin Luther King Jr.'s words are taken as spiritually and personally as the gospel he once taught. He admonished us all to have a dream. And as selflessly as King lived, Ford wishes to leave his institution better than he found it. We want to take Bishop State to the next level and take it from the past and take it to the next generation. In Mobile, Russell Colburn, Fox 10 News. Keeping the dream alive comes just four days before Martin Luther King Jr. Day 2013. That's Monday, January 21st.